Hi everyone, I'm Jesse Jane from Lily Shop and today I'm making a Halloween guacamole. And here with me is Papa. Papa, and we are going to be making the guacamole together. So let's get started. <laughs> All right, to start the guacamole, we need four avocados. <laughs> oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? So we can pick ripe avocados. All right. Shall we start that? I'm, I could have cut my hand off there. So to get the seed out, you just see what he did? Slice it in half. And while he's putting the guacamole in, I mean the avocado, I'm going to add a tomato. And this is about half a cup of tomatoes, and you don't want the seeds, I'm just using the outer portion of the tomato. If you put the seeds in there, it'll get too soggy. So I'll add the tomato. I've never figured out how you got the seeds away. Oh, I just scoop out the seeds. You cut it in half and you scoop out the seeds. All right. Here, I'll move this closer to you. This is half of a white onion. It's a small white onion. So I'm going to slice it up, and you want to dice it into small little pieces. All right. Here comes the onion. Now lemon. This is half of a lemon. Put it in face. Like this? Yeah, yeah. This is cool. Okay. I'll squeeze the whole thing. Jeez. Put some muscle into it. Well, that's a lot of muscle. <laughs> yeah, and here's some more liquid out of this too. All right, this is the green taco sauce. This is my secret ingredient. Oh. Do you add this to your guacamole? I don't even know what it is. I wouldn't add it. Taco sauce. Mm. It's good. All right, so I'm gonna add one tablespoon of the taco sauce. Ooh, eh, a little bit it's more. It's gonna make it hot or what? No, no it's mild. Okay. Just gives it a good flavor in the back. And then to that, we're going to add a couple dashes of green Tabasco sauce. If you have the red, you can use it, but it makes the guacamole turn brown, so I recommend getting the green. Is that so, make it hot? about four dashes. Yeah, this is spicy. Okay. Then to this, we're doing half a teaspoon of garlic powder. So the most important step of the guacamole is to taste it, because if there's not enough salt, you want to add salt, depending on your avocados, if they're not ripe enough. Um, if it needs a little bit more lemon, that's, you know, you kind of have to taste your guacamole as you go. Okay, now we're going to show you how to serve the guacamole for your Halloween party. So take a pumpkin, we already carved this pumpkin, actually, Papa carved this pumpkin. And we just made a regular mouth. Pretty good, eh? Yeah, pretty good. And little eyes, and he's gonna she be... a little soft. Yeah. She's a little soft. Perfect, okay, so let's pile up the guacamole. Go ahead, you do it. All right. You want to use a platter and you want to put it, I hope we have enough, we have enough, close to the mouth. Horrible looking? I mean, it's going to be horrible looking in a minute. You want to make it look like it's coming out of the mouth. I know, it's disgusting, but... We got enough. Now just turn it upside down on his mouth. You want it in his mouth. Yeah. There you go. Ew. Well, you got to make it stick. Jesus, does that look disgusting? <laughs> Lily should be here. She'd love this. Okay. That's, Does it look like it? I think it works. Yeah. Ooh, that's perfect. All right, so here's our chips. So you can serve the chips in a bowl, or you can just put them... Kind of lost my appetite. ...at the end. Just like that. And that's how you make Halloween guacamole. Good job, Papa. Thanks. <laughs> See you next time.